Are you interested in Gary Kasparov's chess masterclass? Maybe you want to learn how to start getting better at chess and winning against all your friends. Today I'll share with you exactly my experience with that course and share with you how much I improved from before watching it to now and hopefully this will help you figure out whether or not you want to get into this course. Here's a little disclaimer though before we get started. You know, depending on your level of experience, your improvement throughout the course will differ greatly. And to be honest, since I've never been a chess expert, if you're already really good at chess, I really can't say how much this course can help you because I myself has always pretty much been a beginner. You see, since I was a kid, I was just playing here and there with friends and family members. None of us took the time to study much into chess. We didn't really study openings. We pretty much played on instinct to see where it would take us. And we played mostly for fun and incredibly casually. I set out to watch Gary Kasparov's chess masterclass because let's face it, I'm kind of a competitive guy at times and I wanted to learn how to, and I wanted to learn how to beat my friends. To make sure I would get the most out of this course, here's how I decided I'd go through it. <clears throat> I'd watch one video a day from the chess masterclass, then I would go on to play three to five games on chess.com against live opponents to practice everything I'd learned on that day's lecture. And finally, I'd review all my notes of that day to make sure I'd remember everything long term and study everything. To measure my progress between before the course and after watching it, I decided I'd do a little experiment. I decided I'd play 20 games before watching the course and then 20 other games on a brand new account after watching the course so I could really compare my results and see how much more I'm winning and what chess rating I get in both instances. So before watching the course, out of 20 games, I got 4 wins, 15 losses and 1 draw. Pretty bad. My final chess rating was estimated at 675. So how much did I improve? After watching the course, after going through all of the course, my, and, and playing another set of 20 games, I got 11 wins and 9 losses for a final chess score of 790. Overall, I improved my chess score by 115 points. And I went from winning 20% of the time to winning 55% of the time. So I almost tripled my winning rate with just this course. Of course, as you may know, every time you're winning on chess.com, their matchmaking algorithm will always pair you with someone that's more and more of your level. So over time, your winning rate goes closer and closer to 50-50, but still, I'm incredibly satisfied with my results. And to be honest, I'm not sure how much I owe my improvements to having played a lot of games and how much I owe my improvements to actually having watched the course's lecture. But overall, very impressed with how much I improve. I see noticeable differences when I play. I mean, it's night and day. I take much less time making decisions. I can start strategizing around creating checkmates many, many turns in advance. I can start seeing my opponent's strategies and tactics. I can see where they're trying to hit me and I can see how to create good defenses. And I can start pulling off really complex maneuvers and start mating not just with rooks and queens, but actually start mating with other pieces such as the uh, bishops and, uh, and knights, which aren't that easy to use when you're a beginner but now I'm, I'm starting to figure out how to use them and actually start mating in many different ways. I start seeing all patterns of how to create double attacks, you know, threatening many pieces at the same time so that I force my opponents many times to give up two pieces for one of my pieces or actually give up one of his pieces without taking any of mine. I get really good trades. You know, most of my games on chess.com, sometimes I fuck up, but most of my games 
when it goes well, I've got huge material advantage. I can't tell you how many times opponents online all the way through that journey, all these 119 games, how many times some of them just decided to rage quit and disconnect from chess.com completely. So as you can see, as a beginner, I really got a lot from this course. I'm not an expert yet, but I, but I feel I can safely say if you already know the basic rules of chess, because let's face it, this course is not about teaching you how the pieces moves, all the basic rules. This course assumes you've probably played a couple of games already. But if you have and you know how to play chess, but you don't know how to play chess well, I think this is an amazing course to watch. It will show you exactly just that. You'll learn how to start beating your friends, how to beat people online, and also how to really enjoy the more advanced and strategic and really start enjoying more advanced aspects of the game. It's really good stuff. If you want to check it out, I've put a link in the description where you can click it and get directly to the page where you can check out this course. With that said, thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, if you want to see more reviews like this coming soon of more courses by famous people or by famous people such as Gordon Ramsay, Dan Locke, and Jordan Peterson, don't forget to subscribe. I've got a lot more reviews coming, two reviews a week. So subscribe if you don't want to miss that. With that said, thanks again for watching and I'll see you soon. Take care.